There's always work to do. Any kind of weather, we're out and we can work every day of the week and every day of the year. I didn't get any holidays there for the last couple of years. Just busy. But, uh Funny thing is, I don't know if I'm on the forward or the harvester tonight. I think I'm on the forward. It's a surprise. Forwarder. Forwarder, that's what it is. It's so nice to be rid of the bad weather. A little bit of frost. It was all the world good. I hardened up the ground. And just as I said that. It's going too soon. Oh, I'm Greg and I have big arms and I think I'm a great lad. Do you, Greg? Do you know? Come on, Greg. Come on. Drop it. Oh, thank you. I love, I love that my machine worries about me. I'm okay. Don't worry about me. Just hold on for dear life and I'll be grand. For all the people messaging me about the podcast I've done with Ed Don, thanks a million. And I was talking to Ed and yes, he will come on again sometime have another chat well it's amazing all the things that you don't ask and people ask me questions that I should ask but that, it was nearly two hours so like you could do five hour podcast but there is a limit to the amount of time you can sit talking so yeah I'll do another one with him again at some stage I would only love it if that started to stick I had to build this home with the kids It is cold. No for that tonight. Nope. Raptor's gone. She's gone. I watched her drive out the lane today for the last time. And I won't lie, a little, little tear started to well up in this eye. Clark then was, I got the end of a needed something to get to work because the vehicle I'm getting isn't here yet story of my life so I'm having a, a caddy there Clark was there that is not yours is it daddy <laughs> oh, so. very funny fuck it's cold oh caddy life she ran a yolk she ran a yolk um I noticed she was Nippy enough now on the way up to the wood. Nippy enough. Nippy little yoke. But when I was driving up the wood road, I had to crawl up. Because the Volkswagens are fair close to the ground and I didn't want to rip the stump over on the first day I had it. So I used to crawl up the wood road when I used to tear up it with the Raptor. That I don't fucking have anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Did you do was hiding? Yeah. Where was it hiding? In your bum. It was a... Hiding in your bum? Yeah. She lying. Hey, I hope we don't get the weather you're expecting. <laughs> Kids have a snow day, which is nice. It's not an awful lot of snow. But you know what? Any amount of snow is enough for a snow day, I think. Some more. It's nice, isn't it? Dad! Yeah? You throwing snowballs at me? Cold. <laughs> you cold? In 15 minutes they'll all be crying, saying their hands are cold. I'm gonna have to run in and try and warm them up. Good girl. What are you doing? Eating snow. Eating snow. Do I want to try some? No thanks. Let's be honest. He isn't gonna be working for Elon Musk, is he?
You big snot, you know us. Mm -hmm. right, how are your hands feeling? Yeah, it's snowing. What's wrong? Cold. Your hands are cold again. Are you going to warm them up again? Yeah. Okay, come on. I'm missing out on all the crack now because of you. <laughs> because you're too cold. Where are you going? Hey, what are you doing? Are you still eating snow? Yeah. Call him. Jane calls him Mr. Snowface. Mr. Snowface? Yes. Very good. He called. Jane, you don't have to do that anymore. <laughs> she's joking. She's not eating the green bit of the water, man. Yes, is that nice? No. It's not? This is so disgusting. <laughs> if it's disgusting, why are you eating it then? No. I'm picking out on donuts. Vicky came in the door. Now she wants me to go get fuel. Brigettes or sticks or something for the fire. And we ran out of home heat now. Last night. <laughs> what are the odds? And I rang in different flatterties and he, he's only after getting a lorry up here. So, in these roads, fair play to him. I'll go get fuel and then get back to go to work. How come we're only one wearing one decent hat and the rest of it is just rubbish? <laughs> he just said, he said, who who owns the hat there? And I said, who do you think? And he said, Vicky. And I says, yeah. And he goes, yeah, it's the most what? Protestant hat I've ever seen. <laughs> He's right. He's fucking and right. And my name. <laughs> Fur brother. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Charmin's off. Uh, Enjoy your night, good. I will do. You too. I will. Yeah. I will. You can't tell me. What a fucking... Sp Gumshy! Garrett's making me work for this. I suppose there's a lorry out there loading stuff. Appreciate that.
spend a little bit of time with them but I uh, first snow kids making snowmen stuff I started thinking about dad and now dad didn't build too many snowmen with us but he used to warm our hands when we come in and out crying and bawling over them but it was the first time that I thought about them and I didn't have to go oh don't think about that don't think about that that'll, that'll make me upset or I could actually think about it and it made me happy I was looking at the kids and I was thinking about when I was young and dad, it was a happy, happy moment and it was the first one and it felt good. And then I felt guilty for feeling good about it, <laughs> but that's another story. But, you know. I'm pretty sure that um, Castletown, no, I could be wrong. Well, it's unlikely. I've only ever been wrong once, and even at that, I'm not even sure. I'm not certain I was wrong. Thank God that stopped the roar and set off. You know, I think the fact that I'd be walking around, because I have the Jeep parked off, off out, I don't feel a bit nervous because I suppose I have the perception that I'm talking to a couple of hundred thousand people here. You're all keeping me company. Now if a deer pins me down to the ground and starts raping me, none of you are going to do fuck off me. If you know it's all in the head, well that'd be in my arse. We try not to think about that, do you know? We just think about the positive things. Like how good a work I'm doing. You probably can't see that. I shouldn't be drinking so much coffee. I go home and be buzzing and I can't sleep. It's me just wind down and then Jane will be in at half five, six o'clock. And it all repeats. Isn't that all sparkly and magic? Is that coming out on the phone? I think it is. It's nice, isn't it? It's like little microscopic fairies everywhere. Oh, there's the jib. <laughs> 